I'm Dennis, developer advocate at the United Manufacturing Hub. In this last video of our five component UNS basics series, we will discuss protocol controllers. Before we do so, in the last video, we discussed data contextualization. The link will be posted here above. And we saw that at the end of the data contextualization, we obtain our final data in a specific topic hierarchy with a specific schema for the message payload. But what if our data is not initially published as MQTT? We are using an MQTT broker, so the protocol that communicates the data should be MQTT. Well, if it's not in the beginning, then we will have to use a so-called protocol converter that will convert the initial protocol of the data, for instance, OPC UA, into MQTT so that it can be understood and written by the broker. If you have OPC UA for event data, this conversion is straightforward. It can become more complex if we look at the various other types of data we have in manufacturing. Imagine you have a database like the MES system. Well, in that case, your data is no longer event-based. It's now a relational database structure. And the language is, is, is a SQL or SQL. In that case, the protocol conversion will be less straightforward, although of course it can still be done. Now, inside the UMH stack, protocol conversion can be done for simple cases, simply using Node-RED. But for, let's say, more stable requirements in production, or for more complex protocol conversions, or for higher volumes of data, you will most likely use a tool like Bentos. And the UMH adapted Bentos to their specific stack, as you can see in this article here. And essentially for the purpose of this video, it's enough to know that Bentos allows you to configure protocol conver converters using YAML syntax in a text file. Right, so this concludes the five components we discussed for our unified namespace. As always, I would really encourage you to read this blog article in more detail. It will be linked here below, as long with the other two articles I shared about data in manufacturing and Bentos UMH. I hope you enjoyed the series. Thank you a lot for watching.